All right, one card goes on the bottom, a multi six for Roland. And we are underway. Cavern of Souls. Me human and mother of roots. Prismatic ending immediately removes mother of runes. Some big bets coming in from the Twitch chat. On the outcome of this match, Wasteland on Tundra, Mother Runes again. Um, I'm going to crack the bottle, target pass. Alrighty. Alright, so Mother Runes will stick around. Tropical Island. And a fetch. Counter balance is in there. I don't think Roland's particularly worried about that. Spirit of the Labyrinth, pretty good. Accumulated knowledge revealed on top counter, is it? Wow. Wow. I'm going to bolt this to and then yeah, yeah, just trigger. Uh, so he's a 5-5 now. Yep. Uh, so yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, no further plays from Roland. Looks like Phil has a source to plowshares in hand and a force of will. Merchant scroll that resolves. Give me pop quiz. Pop quiz is found. I don't know if Twitch chat is familiar with this card, so I'll put it up on the screen. Three mana draw a card, learn. Instant. Force of Phil, everybody. <laughs> Squeller Time says Bowmaster makes tokens, legacy white black tokens deck with Bowmaster and staff. So keep in mind, though, that a mass doesn't continue to make tokens, it just adds on to the one token you have. Um, and apparently Twitch chat didn't draft Strixhaven either. What does learn mean? Learn means you can choose a lesson card from your sideboard and put it into your hand. <laughs> Come on, people. Where were you when Strixhaven came out? That's true. You can also discard to draw a card. That's true. Thank you, Frodo. Hey, it's Frodo, everybody. Frodo's here. Frodo, it's been a big week for you. Big week for Frodo. Stoneforge Mystic on the stack. Cavern most likely on core. Getting your... <laughs> Roland forgot to search for a moment there. <laughs> Are you good? You need a second? Yeah, give me one second. So this one is 10 counters. It has zero. So I think obviously it's zero on the attack. Because if you take this one, that's what it's going to be. The other deck I have is Which one is a damage? I mean, I guess with cards, I guess. Yeah, Delver. Delver is like, if he's played standard, he can get your turn. He can at least manage Delver. Oh, 
Lion Sash chosen. Okay. And knows that Force of Phil likes to play games with Mystic Sanctuary, so seems like a decent choice. Merchant Scroll. Found two Tundras. And Brainstorm is found off Merchant Scroll. Okay. Oh, what does that say on Cavern of Souls chat? What does that say? I can't read it. Artificer, maybe? Maybe trying to get some extra points with Loran. Wasteland on Tundra, okay. People need Sharpies. Yeah, this is a really low budget channel, everybody. We don't really have Sharpies on standby. Okay, Twitch chat says it says cleric. Okay, so Stoneforge apparently could have been countered. Lion Sash dropped in here. Thank you, Twitch chat. One person said Sveldegriff. That can't be right. We need more Feldegriffs in Magic, though, right? 57% favor for Miracles, said Twitch chat as we were getting started. Bold prediction. Okay, Thalia, Guardian of Thraben, not a cleric. Brainstorm in response. Uh, yeah. Okay, force pitching ponder on Thalia, attacking with Stoneforge and Lion Sash. Two damage. Field of Ruin comes in, pass the turn. Terminus. Oh my god. Oh, oh. you're fucking up so bad. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to drop a turn now. Yeah, yeah. 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 All right, so fought through a uh, Thalia and then resolved a Terminus. Yeah, low budget channel filming high budget cardboard. I, I, I think that's the best way to put it, Specchio. It's a weird show. All right, Field of Ruin targeting, I believe, Tundra. And not finding anything. That's not good. I'm surprised Phil doesn't have basics to find. Fair enough. Hamel time. Thanks for the sub with Prime. Looks like a first time sub. I appreciate that. Surgical. And the tundras are gone. Sheesh. <laughs> Force of Hill here in the chat. The literal first time I play the full greed mana base without basics. And this is what happens to me. Never leave your home without basics. Great advice from Force of Phil, everybody. Great advice. All 
All right, so Tundra is exiled. Um, okay, so there was a mer um, merchant scroll and a source of plowshare is in hand. It's going to be hard to find white mana in this game going forward. Here's a brainstorm. We know Triumph of St. Catherine is floating around on this deck somewhere. Misty Rainforest getting cracked here. Is there a chance of a Savannah or something? Probably not, right? Okay, it's another drop. Casting Merchant Scroll. Accumulated Knowledge. Interesting. Cavern on Elemental this time. This time I heard it. Yep. Flick a wisp. Exiles okay. okay. the planes, puts the planes back. Accumulated knowledge gets cast. Main phase. Brainstorm now. Yeah, I mean that that was puts Merchant Scroll on top. So Roland has an attacker now with three power. Swords of Plowshares appears to be shut off at the moment. So does Terminus. As, at least as far as we can tell. Did Phil only put one back with that brainstorm? I don't know, but the but the YouTube commenters will be. Yeah, I'll keep it. I'll keep it. All right, both players have kept Tundra Ponder. Valuable Tundra. <laughs> what if Roland starts this game Wasteland Surgical and it resolves? It doesn't happen. Plains. Tropical Island. Counterbalance. Death and Taxes presents a decent spread of different mana values. Makes it a little bit hard to... Uh, use counterbalance, but as we saw in, in the previous game, it does catch stuff sometimes. Uh oh, something happening here. Looking up Oracle text. Maybe Roland just checking their email, I don't know. We go with four on this. Okay. Okay, this time it's on core. And Stoneforge. What will Roland find this time? Will it be Lion Sash again? Nope, it's College Complete, it looks like. Yeah. Ponder. Swords on Stoneforge, okay. Uh, Pass the turn. Either Vile's in there. 
Forge in port. Stone Forge once again. Cavern is on core, so it, it resolves. No reaction from Phil on that. Yeah, the Vial could potentially be removed by our Prismatic ending. Stone Forge definitely worth killing as a creature. This time, Lion Sash was found by Stone Forge and Tundra fetched up. Storm for Phil. Yes, this match is from this past Monday. Phil pointing out Roland played this match exceptionally, bored in a way it was just not even remotely on my radar. Okay. up to one. Activating Stone Forge, it looks like. To terminus on end step. So it's rolling in an awkward spot as far as the stone forge. Didn't use it on his own turn, and stone forge will go on the bottom. Okay, activating port here, targeting trop. Triumph of St. Catherine comes in. The surgical seems reason reasonable just for um, Mystic Sanctuary shenanigans. Maybe Roland wasn't really planning on the surgical tundra plan but it also can i mean most of uh roland's effects that remove creatures are exile but if a triumph dies in combat can also surgical that Eucalyptus with a great question as Lion Sash is the board here. Chris, do you do this holiday thing in which you take a break and we have to miss the weekly dose? You deserve it and all, but I would like to be prepared. If you mean me taking a week off from streaming, yes, I, I've done that a bunch. Uh, the people who watch this later on YouTube, they don't know what's going on, when the stream was, and when the matches happened. They have no idea. So I don't tell them anything. But the Twitch chat knows. The Twitch chat knows. Sometimes I disappear for a little bit. And they get really angry at me, actually. How dare you take a week off? Don't you care about legacy and the format and all of its play patterns? All right. <laughs> Farron McCobb uh, exiles the uh, accumulated knowledge. Brainstorm here. Merchant scroll revealed on top. Lion Sash counter, Triumph of St. Catherine gets in there. I was I was thinking about if I should walk over and mention it. 
Side Norna says, seeing there's a counterbalance, this stream is from t 2018. It could be. It could be. Who knows? Merchant scroll for brainstorm. Activating vial. X is, I mean, two charge counters on it. Stone Forge comes in. You see in the bottom right hand of your screen our little fuel tank, our sub goal of 330. We're, we're, we're not really close to it right now. But when I take a week off, it completely depletes, goes down to zero. Everybody unsubscribes from 90s MTG. It's bad. They all just leave. All right, a sword's on Stoneforge Mystic. Batter Skull is the card found and put in hand. Yeah, no one's ready for Southwest. Right. Because right. um, I haven't been dealt in any game. Something like that? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 Or the most important number, or whatever. Could get recruiters and flicker wisps. It all gets really annoying. Vial on three. Three is the magic number, side Norna. That is right. Wasting Tundra. Uh oh. Yuri on to hand. And we might see a port on Tundra. And that's exactly what happens. And there it is Recruiter of the Guard vialed in. No reactions from Phil. I like it when Side Norna's here in the chat with us. Side Norna usually picks up on some really important uh, rules and, and gameplay stuff that most of us miss. Shout out to Side Norna. All right, Solitude was chosen. That's Solitude in hand. That could potentially be a way to remove this Triumph of St. Catherine, which is causing lots of problems right now. Vile takes up to four. I used to play a white card. I wanted to, John, John said play two, so I call it two chains, but. <laughs> potentially the plan here is to tick up Vile to five and Vile in the Solitude, absorbing another hit in the meantime. A cavern on elemental could also be an option, but given that the vial ticked up, I don't think that's the plan. Here's Caracas. Triumph is not legendary, in case anybody's not familiar. Yeah, yeah Rollins? I mean, uh, Sidon is uh, very interested in the pizza rats of New York City. Very interesting. Tapping down that tundra again with Richard in port. Cavern of Souls is on core still, in case anybody's wondering. Phil goes up at 30. It looks like passes the turn. Vial will go up to 5. Solitude is in hand. So Triumph of St. Catherine's Days might be numbered. Does Force of Phil have a dress down? Is uh, worth thinking about, although Roland could just choose to put nothing in and wait till the following turn. 
Otherwise, not really a great way to stop it from happening. Attacking with Recruiter. Doesn't seem like Phil has Uro in the deck. There's a mana for it, but I don't think it's in there. Recruiter over the guard, once again. Triumph of St. Catherine is the card on top. It could be a problem. It could also change Roland's plan as far as this recruiter is concerned. Let's see what Roland finds here. Looks like a Stoneforge Mystic was chosen. I can't quite make out what that was, but I'm pretty sure it's a Stoneforge. It's in the top left of your screen. I'm like 90% sure. I barely got it. Core is on, uh, Cavern is on Core, so if it is a Stoneforge, it won't be able to be countered. Did you get a game on the Yeah, we went to, that's not a rematch. Tapping Tundra on Phil's upkeep. Accumulated knowledge and response. Trying to get this triumph onto the battlefield. This is clever. This would be Phil's first card drawn this turn. Maybe Roland should have waited for... No, you can't really wait for draw stuff because then he just draws the triumph. Yeah, I don't know. Bill gets another triumph in play. Back of it in vile before draw stuff. Solitude. Remove the one that was already there. Makes sense. No, once your upkeep ends, your floating mana is gone. Wasteland on Tundra. Phil's officially off of white. For now. Stoneforge. Conwick, thanks for the sub with Prime. Appreciate that. Looks like a first time sub. Thank you, thank you. There's always Jitte on the bottom left of your screen. Love the YouTube content, mate. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for being here. Yuri on uh, Viled in here. I guess we're going to see Solitude do its thing. And Recruiters. All right. Second triumph is removed. It was up to 39 and double recruiter trigger. Let's see what Roland finds here. I saw a cataclysm while Roland was sifting through the deck. At least I think it was. Could be... What does Roland want here? Are there any other five drops besides Solitude? I don't think so. Okay, gets, goes for Solitude and another Solitude. All right, goes for double Solitude. So Roland will have double Solitude with a Vial on five for the rest of the game. Plenty of power on the board right now. Passing the turn. Brainstorm. <laughs> Roland wants a life totals to be flipped. Yeah. Let's try him from St. Catharines. Gained Phil a lot of life. But Roland right now has a pretty quick clock. I mean, it's 10 power on the board currently.
Merchant Scroll. Phil needs white mana once again. Phil calling accumulated knowledge a trap that Phil fell into. Accumulated knowledge. Spirit of the Labyrinth countered by counterbalance, revealing counterbalance. I'll attack. Are you getting the attack? Attack. Uh, Four seven nine. <laughs> there is still a batter skull in Roland's hand, I think. Well, am I thinking of the previous game? There's also a Jite in hand, right? Or is Jite in the graveyard now? I think it's still in hand. I lost track. I'll cast the accumulated knowledge. So you can get off. Yep, it's good. It's good. Sure. Accumulated knowledge. Uh, drop turn? Yep. Ponder. Yeah, Caracas, Urion, Aethervile on five, such value. I agree. It's a little risky to activate Caracas, um, especially now that there's a uh, Flood Assurance on the battlefield. All right, so putting a Solitude onto the battlefield, no targets. You want to use your Caracas to protect Urion most likely. I mean, when Ro when Phil didn't have uh, white mana, maybe it was a little safer to do that. Okay, activating Stoneforge. Oh, there was still a College of Complete in hand. Okay, I, I lost track at this point. What was in Roland's hand? So College of Complete comes in. There's a germ. This is a big attack. This could be a two-turn clock here. So six, seven, eight, thirteen, plus the seventeen. Oh, sorry, I'm forgetting this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Six, eight, twelve, eighteen. Uh, seventeen. Seventeen, yeah, seventeen. <laughs> Both players had a little trouble counting all that up. All right, so seventeen damage. Uh, yeah, too much math. I can never take this out of the way. I'm just, I'm just trying to run the table with the front of the back. Yeah, Terminus is mandatory at this point. Uh, <laughs> you need four of them. Or two of them out. Yeah, Roland has the Urion stuff happening, so it's not likely Phil will be able to break through this vantage bar way over to the left right now. Terminus not good enough. Uh, uh, shuffle. Fetch. Uh, 
I love so when I have to like comment on spots. They're, uh, but then I also really scared. Yeah, right. Terminus going on top of the deck. I see a brainstorm floating in Phil's hand. So could potentially try and terminus on Roland's turn. We already discussed how that is not that amazing in this current situation because of Caracas, Vile, Urion. Vile has five charge counters on it. Discarding force to hand size. Yeah, killing Vile would, would be something, but uh, Phil does not have that option. So a brainstorm on the stack. This is on Roland's upkeep. Revealing Terminus. Its miracle trigger will go on the stack momentarily. And now casting Terminus. Roland going to uh, think about which way to do this. All right, so Urion goes back to hand with Caracas in response. Now Roland has drawn a card. Not sure why a card was drawn there. Maybe the players communicated that this was after Roland's draw step. Don't know. All right, so Urion has exiled the team. And they're placed on standby. Terminus resolves. It will go on the bottom. Roland in the chat saying it was during the draw step. So a draw step terminus puts Yuri on the bottom. What happened to Calder complete? Where'd that go? It should still be on the board, right? Look who is. It's back Caracas, okay. Or blinks Caracas or whatever. Oh, okay, so uh, Calder Complete was was blinked. Okay, I didn't, I, I didn't see where it went with the whole Urion situation. Yeah, it gets a new germ. Exactly. I felt like I saw it on the board and then it went away and I lost track of it. All right, another Terminus. It looked like. But Phil didn't cast it. Am I right on that? Uh, okay, so the white was tapped down on upkeep. Okay. This is a bit hard to follow. Merchant Scroll now. Thank you, Roland, helping out in the chat. Merchant Scroll now. Urion is gone. So the Caracas Vile thing is shut off at the moment. Phil can potentially try to... Uh, okay, that's uh, the Learn Lesson card. That we saw earlier. Three mana draw a card. Learn. Yeah, I'm thinking about Man, the fun, fun uh, match of the, the first uh, experiment that I go with. 